how will you feel if I tell you that there are simple strategies you need to follow on Binance to make a lot of money even in a bear market? <laughs> and that is exactly what I'm going to share with you in this video. Hello, welcome to the video. It's Leonard here again. And in today's video tutorial, I'm going to share with you four simple strategies you can follow using the Binance Exchange and make a lot of money for yourself even in a bear market. All right. Even why others are panicking, why people are getting liquidated, I'm going to show you how to position yourself as a smart investor and a trader. All right, to take advantage of what Binance has to offer and use it to make money for yourself when you see um, a, a bear movement like this. All right, why every other person is panicking and asking a lot of questions? Why should this happen? Why is Bitcoin? Bitcoin is dead, and the rest. Yours is just to position yourself and take advantage of this, and you can make a lot of money from it if you follow the simple strategy that I'm going to share with you in this video. So make sure you watch the video to the end. All right. So one thing I should let you know before we go further is that what is happening is in the market right now is not new whenever you are in doubt in the crypto market always make sure that you zoom out all right so right here you see that there is a major support line here at um this 30 between 30 um 29 30 dollars and the rest okay if i zoom out here all right if i zoom out let me just share with you what is happening right now happened sometime in january of 2021 okay before we had that breakthrough that went to 68 and the rest okay sometime in january of 2021 we had that major pullback okay after bitcoin um actually you know skyrocket to around 41 42 000 then we have this major pullback all right and it was around this area the same area that bitcoin is currently trading all right that it was and then all of a sudden everything boom to the air all right and then when the market got to um around 60 64000 okay everything started pulling down all right and the pull down this happened this pull down happened between um sometime in between may and july all right so here okay you see that bitcoin from 64000 it pulled down to what the current level that we are trading right now all right so between may this happened between may and um july all right this happened between may it, it happened in may and then it pulled up again to around 40 and then it came down again to the same level that we are currently trading on right now all right and that is exactly what is happening here okay it happened sometime um this year early this year around january and it is happening again in may okay it is happening again in may and there is every tendency that if this market reverse from here okay we could be hitting a new all-time high or we could even come back to where um the uh, all-time high of 2021 which is around 60 68 thousand dollars all right so what is happening in the market the essence of sharing this with you is that what is happening in the market right now is not new in the crypto space okay it is not new in the crypto space it is in fact it is becoming normal right now it is becoming normal right now but if you are going to become a trader and um, a smart one at that all you just look at is taking advantage of um, a movement in the market right right now okay all you look at is taking advantage of this kind of movement in the market and i will share with you these four simple strategies that you can use to take advantage of this in the market all right so for you to be able to um follow and implement these strategies you need a binance account if you don't have a binance account already you can sign up for one all right and when you sign up as a user once you get your binance account verified you get um five busd as a welcome bonus you don't need the only tax you need to do is just to verify your account and you get this credited into your account so if you don't have a binance account already link will be in the video description to sign off an account all right so the first strategy that i want to tell you um this is using common sense all right i know common sense is not common but you need to apply this to be able to make um a lot in the market now as i just shared with you this pullback right now we are on a support level that we were sometime in january of 2021 in may of 2021 january this year and this is another pullback all right so if this doesn't break this level that we are right now and continue to go down there is every tendency that there will be a pullback from this level 
so all you will be waiting for all right is first you can trade this in features all right you can trade this in features and how do you do that you come to binance you come in here to binance go to derivatives you go to um usdtm features okay you go and open a position all right you can open a position at thirty thousand. you can open a position even below that all right i have i had some you know position that have you know some limit or others that i set at thirty thousand. all right and the one that is currently trading right now i entered this early enough i entered this early enough but i'm ready to hold this okay i'm ready to hold this because right now if you look at my liquidation price i'm using cross mode um i have not no no price is showing up here meaning that my account is still very safe but I'm going to enter another position at 30,000. Once Bitcoin hit 30,000, if it doesn't hit 30,000, another position I want to enter is at 32,000. All right. So when the market starts reversing, if it continues this reversal movement from, you know, 30,400, 30,300, or 200, and it gets to 32,000, I want to take another position. But if it continues to go down, I want to open another position. I have, um, I want to, you know, enter the market again at 30,000. All right so you just take advantage of this and this is only for features traders this is only for features traders and whenever the market go increases by either one percent two percent zero point five percent whatever you want to take profit at you can go ahead and take profit at this level okay and if you don't want to close your trade you can use the trailing stop order okay the trailing stop order to you know once you are in profit use the trailing stop order to follow the market that is the first step to do open a futures position all right you can go ahead it could be in bitcoin it could be in any coin of your choice because right now everything in the market is down all right so the first strategy that i have to share with you is now that we are on a major support level all right there is every tendency that this price will pull back so you open a position around this level a long position around this level and wait for it to hit your target now the second strategy that i'm going to share with you still on futures trading is to leverage on the binance strategy trading mode okay here when i come to strategy trading you see that we have features grid here okay you can leverage on this if i click on it so if i click on it it opens up you can go ahead and trade this um features grid with any coin of your choice because right now everything in the market is down so if you want to do for btc all right i love going with the grid um um features grid trading mode i love going with the auto setting all right so you just select the token you want to trade okay you select the token let's say you want to trade eth you go ahead and select that token once you select it all right the next thing is to come in here to this interface here and make sure you are on the auto mode okay you can use the manual mode if you want all right if you are an expert trader you know the parameters you want to set for yourself you can go ahead and use the manual mode but i normally use the auto mode okay when i use the auto mode you have um, the option of going long or going short but normally i trade on a neutral mode so when i go with the neutral mode um binance automatically with the grid board automatically opens you know position both long and short position for me and it feels that accordingly all right and then the third way all right you can do this is just by simply using spot trading mode all right so if you come in here to your spot trading mode all you just need is hover over trade and then click on spot and then this interface open up so you can come in here and start using either market order or limit order to buy any token of your choice you can buy bitcoin you can buy ethereum you can buy any token of your choice all right you can buy any token of your choice right now if you buy bitcoin let's say you buy one or two bitcoin right now there's every tendency that um in few weeks from now bitcoin could go back to 40 to 50 thousand and you will be either 10,000 5,000 20,000 richer depending on what your target or how patient you'll be able to wait for the market to you know recover and stuff like that so you just come in here to the spot mode and buy crypto for yourself using the spot mode all right using the spot mode so basically why others are panicking and they are selling in the market all you just need to do is to take advantage of you know this dip in the market buy some crypto for yourself hold it and wait for the market to recover will the market recover yes the market will surely recover all right so the earlier you enter the market the better it will be for you when everything start recovering all right and the last but not the least way okay the fourth way or the fourth strategy that you can make money in a bear market is if i come in here to 
the p2p interface all right so if i come in here to the p2p interface and how do you access the p2p interface from the binance exchange you just go to buy and then you go to p2p all right so once you come in here um i can buy usdt and then sell in busd it's as simple as that all right so you see that BUSD right now is currently trading or people are ready to sell at 603 Naira, okay, per U BUSD. And then the USDT, people are ready to sell at 599, 600 Naira per USDT, all right? Now, please take note of this. I am not saying buy and then use the sell option, no. I say buy on the Binance exchange, okay, you buy BUSD then you can come in and create ad for yourself okay to sell BUSD you buy USDT and then you create ad for yourself to sell BUSD because when you click on sell um, the profit you may not really make the profit meaning that for you to be able to achieve this to make this kind of profit you need to become a merchant with the Binance exchange so when you come in here to the USDT you see the offers people are ready to you know sell their USDT so you are buying these offers from these people at 599 600 remember I have this only show merchant are checked meaning that whoever I'm going to buy from you see that they are verified merchant from Binance all right you see the check mark there they are verified merchant from Binance so I can buy at 600 buy USDT at 600 from these people okay and then i'll come in here to busd this is what people are ready to sell at busd okay um 603 naira 603 naira 603 612 naira 625 naira and the rest okay so you just come in here and create an ad for you to sell all right so as a merchant you are creating an ad for you to sell even if you are not a merchant you can still create ads here and people can still buy from from you when, once your offer are good so you create your ad and make sure that you can see that this person is ranking first because um he or she is selling at 603 naira all right and this person is ranking second because he or she is selling at 300 603 naira 28 kobo okay so 603 naira if you make your own 603 naira 20 kobo you could be ranking before these people ranking um 28 kobo all right and then if you make your own 602 naira um 90 kobo you could be ranking first before this person all right so that so that this, these are the simple strategy meaning that when people come here they will see your offer first and it is you they want to buy from because definitely if i want to buy i would definitely buy from this person that is selling at 600 and uh, three naira okay there are other things you need to consider like the limit the person is ready to sell or buy and the amount available amount in the person's account depending if you want to buy more okay it means that you need to buy from different traders and so on so the price is not stable okay it keeps changing all right you buy usdt at 600 and then you come in here to be usd you create your ad to sell now if you are in mesh and another way you can use the binance p2p interface is that when i come in here to sell okay these are what people are ready to buy all right these are what missions are ready to buy from you like this person is ready to buy at five 98 buy one BAUSD usd at 598 that is if you have your crypto and you want to sell it to your bank account this is what you are going to sell it at and these people will buy it and in turn sell it back to you because definitely when you send the money to your bank account you will equally see an opportunity to buy back so when you come back to buy back you are buying more costlier than you sold okay so that is one advantage you come in here to create us to buy crypto from people you can buy BUSD, you can buy usdt btc bnb ethereum and the rest you buy it from them and then create an ad to sell back so when they come back to buy they'll be seeing your ad here okay they'll be seeing your ad here. so make sure for you to be able to always get sales you need to look at the market okay and see what the last person is selling here and make your own a little bit lower with either um one kobo two kobo three kobo and your ads will be ranking first and once it is ranking first you will always be the number one person people will be buying from all right and another reason why you need to become a merchant all right you don't need, really need to become a merchant to do um create ads here to do this buying and selling but another reason why you need to become a merchant is that people get to trust you more because you are verified you by you are verified by binance okay people get to trust you more 
so when you get verified people get to trust you and you know they can easily carry a transaction with you without thinking twice and so on so basically these are just the four different ways i decided to share with you in this video and all of this can be accomplished on the binance platform if you don't have a binance account use the link in the video description to sign up for an account and everything i've demonstrated here can be done on your mobile the binance mobile app on your phone all right so sign up for an account and the first thing you need to consider is Whenever people are panicking because of this, the red market, you know, everything is going down. All you just need to do is to position yourself either as a future trader, okay, open a future trading position. You can leverage on the Binance great trading strategy and, you know, use it to automate your future trading. Or you can go to spot market, okay, to buy, all right, buy low. And whenever the market goes high, you sell. Or you come into P2P and see how you can, you know, be buying crypto from those who are ready to sell and then sell it back to them at a higher price. So these are just the simple strategy I needed to share with you. If you leverage on this, you can decide to do the whole four, the whole four or you decide to do the ones that you are comfortable with right now. And believe me, with this simple strategy, you can be making um, small, small money for yourself in the market depending on the size of your capital. So that is it for this video. If you gain value from the video, give it a thumbs up. And um, and if you do have any issue, you can always use the comment section. If you want to learn more about crypto, link to join my Telegram group will be in the video description. And I will see you guys in the next video.